Hey guys, my name is Austin Gregory, and in this course, I'm going to teach you how to create a simple little multiple choice quiz game where you can ask questions in different forms from audio, images, or just simple text questions. And then you have a choice of answers ranging from two choices up to however many you can fit on your screen. So I can continue a game from where I left off. It will take me to the set or the topic of questions that I made it to, whereas new game will start me from the very beginning here. And what I can see is my first question is an audio question. I can listen to the sound. Okay, that sounds like a flute. Go to the next question. What color are these flowers? Well, they're not orange or black. I'm gonna say they're magenta. And then I have a nice little score screen here that says you had two questions, you got two right, so your score is 100%. Now, typically you would have more than two questions and you'd probably get some wrong, but that's just how this is going to work because I know the answers to these questions, unfortunately. What country does this shape most represent? This is going to be Germany. It's not Italy or France for sure. So it's Germany. And which of these items is cheese? Now, that could be a difficult question if I tried on this question. There's a lot of cheese names that are confusing and unusual. But in this case, provolone, umbrella is obviously not. And there we go, back to the main menu. And I can continue from the last set that I opened up. So in between sets, we have a score screen. And then in the last set, we go back to the main menu. Just a nice little system that will allow you to create whatever kind of quiz game you have in mind. My name is Austin Gregory, and I will see you in the first lesson.